What's up Space Cadets, this is KJ48 and welcome back to my Imperion Galactic Survival Let's Play. Uh, I've got a couple things to catch you up on and then I'm going to let you know what we're going to be doing for the, this episode and next episode. First of all, we have to go over something that's really, really freaking awesome. Update 5.2. I know I'm a little bit late on this, this was like a few days ago, but this is awesome. All right, get this. They added the first version of a fixed drilling mode, uh, FDM for easy, uh, HV drilling. Okay, press shift zero to activate the mode. And basically what it does is, all right, I'll show you right now what it does. I mean, it's, I'm not sure if there's something wrong with this HV or HVs in general. I'm going to try some new HVs because this thing is really like kind of moving around and stuff and just, I love it. I mean, it gets the job done, but it's really kind of hard to maneuver. So basically what this new mode does is, let's say you want to point down. What you would do is you would hold in, what is it, shift? Yeah, shift O. No, you got to hold down shift and then press O. There you go. Now, if you look on the bottom right hand side right here, it says drill mode fixed. You'll basically stay pointing the direction you're going in. Does it make it easier to drill? I don't know. I play. I did drill off camera for a little while. It didn't really make it any easier for me, but it, I might just be doing it wrong. There might be something strange with this drilling machine. By the way, I love the ladybug. I'm not bagging on it. This thing is freaking awesome. You should have seen how much iron this thing got me. Well... I can actually show you how much iron this thing got me. So check this out. I've got... Um, oh boy, I've actually gone through most of it. Okay, well that's okay. Because what I'm doing is... Uh, I have a little catchphrase I like to use in 7 Days of Dying. I'm going to use it in this game as well. It's called ABC. Always be crafting. So instead of like leaving your ores in here, go ahead and craft the ingots. By the way, there was another update, I think in 5.1, uh, where I forgot to mention a really critical part of the update. Maybe I mentioned it, maybe I didn't, I don't know, but I haven't been using it. If you hold down control and click, you now can put a hundred of anything in the crafting queue. Oh man, this thing is, this is just a wonderful, a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful setup. So we're just going to go ahead and set up a bunch of stuff to craft while I'm out. ABC, always be crafting, words to live by. Let's just craft a bunch of crap while we're gone because we're going to be going out and exploring some sites. Looking at the sites, having a good time. You guys might be asking, well, hold that thought. You're going to be asking a question. I'll be answering it, but give me one second because I need to finish up with this update. Okay, so what else we got here? Okay, so they added an auto level to player drone. So this is really, really awesome. Your player drone now has an auto leveler. Y you can look up, you can look down, but you can't go side to side. I love this. This is such a great update. If you want to deactivate it, you just press O. And now you can start going to the... Wait, actually, I'm sorry, what is it? Uh, o turns it off, yeah. So there you go. So O turns it off, so then you can go side to side and upside down. But I don't like it. I like it to stay level and just be level. I really like that addition to the drone. Really, really cool. Now, the best part of 5.2... Man, wait until you see this, guys. This is going to blow your hair back. Look! We can now plant fiber. Check it out. So fiber is used for growing plots, which is... One of the, you know, it's, it's a bit annoying to get growing plots. Actually, it's used for, yeah, it's used for growing plots. And I think it's used for, no, just growing plots. Uh, yeah. So they're used for growing plots. And it's one of the biggest problems I have with making growing plots. So I always, go after, I always have to go out and farm it. But now you can make plant, you can grow plant fibers. That is going to be an, inc you might think if you're new to the game, eh, cage, whatever, just go grab the plant fiber. We need a lot of these growing plots, and being able to grow plant fiber is huge. I even stopped growing tomatoes and have the fiber growing in here. And the reason we need the plant fibers is because we are going to be... The reason we need the growing plots is because we are going to be making our base soon. It's not going to happen this episode. I apologize about that. Not, you know, not much I can do about that. But... We're going to have it, and that's all that really matters. It's going to be awesome. Another thing you guys told me in the comments that I, I was not aware of is you can actually shift-click. I've been dragging stuff over here, but you don't have to do that. You can actually shift-click to have stuff just go in there. So let's finish up that iron. We're going to throw another thousand in there. I'm going to have to farm some more iron off camera, probably. Actually, maybe before I throw a thousand there, I should see what kind of iron I got in here. I do not have a lot. Actually, whoa, I really don't have a lot of iron in here. Oh, boy. <laughs> After this thing's built, I only have about 800 iron. That kind of blows, but that's all right. We'll get some more. All right, so we are now ready to start production on this. It's going to take almost three hours. That is fine. It's not going to be ready for this video. I knew it wouldn't be, 
but that is okay. It will be ready for next video. Uh, another thing I want to show you is I did go out and farm up some Alien Plasma ZR1. Uh, Alien Plasma ZR1 is found in these forests. I don't know where it's found in Omicron, but I know it's found in these forests on this planet. And I think there's one over here. I'd like to show you it. If I can, okay, so this one this one hasn't grown yet. It looks like a mushroom, okay? And this one hasn't grown back yet, but that's what it looks like, except bigger. Anytime you see that stuff, make sure you pick it, because it is used for a really, really important item that I'm going to delay and then tell you as soon as I get to the spot. Okay, so it's actually used for the small med kits. Uh, purified water, easy to get. And let's, uh, let's go ahead and make a bunch of these. 10, uh, 20... And they'll make a bunch of purified water. Uh, I don't know if they're going to... Oh, yeah, I should make coffee because coffee is actually used in... Ooh, eggplant parts? I wonder where I get eggplant parts. Uh, oh, yeah, wait, what do I like? Oh, I like the adrenaline shot. Yeah, we need the coffee coffee. Okay. There we go. All right, guys, well... Basically, what we're going to do now is we are going to go out and explore there's a couple there's a couple areas i want to look at for this video uh number one i want to check out the crashed ms titan back part and if we have time after that i'm going to check out this admin ts akua building because i don't really recognize it i don't know if i took out these small outposts i think i did but if we didn't we might have to mess with these i'm not really sure but i really like to check out that ts akua i, I don't think it's going to be anything special there but i i don't remember ever being there it's i don't know so we're definitely going to go check it out. All right, so let's get going. Okay, so uh, Crash Titan is directly south. So let's go check out that Crash Titan. There is going to be drones around the Crash Titan, possibly. So we need to be ready for that. Should not be too much of a problem. Oh, there's one. There's two. There's three. Whew. All right. Miss. Miss! Oh, come on, you bastard. I gotta get some better guns for this thing. If they're just gonna spin around in circles, I can't really hit them. Alright. This guy's really pissing me off. Let's get him. Let's take him out. You're going down, my friend. Yeah! Dodge that, bitch. That's what you get. Oh, smoked. So is that it for drones? Oh, there was only two. I saw the uh, name of the of the MS Titan and I thought that was a drone. Okay, fair enough. Okay. We have not I am going to be taking apart parts of this parts of this ship, but probably not too many. I did I did not make the tier 2 Sorry, one second. This game has, like, controls that's really different from all the other games I play. I should probably remap them. Anyway, I didn't get a chance to make the multi-tier 2. That's okay. We will do without. Basically, I have the multi-tier... I have the multi-tool tier 2. Multi-tool tier 2. Like, what the hell? Say that five times fast. Um, anyway, I have the multi-tool tier 2 learned. I have what I need to make it, but the problem is I don't have the... The crafting facility to make it. The tier 2 multi-tool. You need the... Uh, the big constructor. Now, I did make a big constructor, but I didn't put it down. I'm not really that worried about it. We'll make it when we... Uh... Wait, why isn't this working? Wait a minute. Can I not take that apart with this thing? This thing doesn't have a... Does this thing have a, a core? I don't remember the I don't remember the ship ever having a core. Hmm. That is interesting. I don't remember the ship ever having a core, but if I can't take stuff apart, then that's gotta be what it is. Yeah, it's weird. Okay. Well, fair enough. We'll have to find the core, I guess. I really don't remember. I haven't been in this ship in quite a while though, so it might just be that I don't remember it. I'm really kinda worried about the drones in the area, but whatever. Uh, I don't want to go down here. Don't want to go up there. Okay. I don't expect to have any resistance in here either. 
Okay. We're going to loot as we go. I didn't really like that whole, like, looting at the entrance thing. I don't know. It's, it's all right, but if you loot as you go, you get the loot anyway. And you don't have to take all the extra time to go through all those things. Son of a bitch. I fell for their dirty, dirty trap. Ha! <laughs> These freaking aliens are bastards. Did you see that? They freaking trapped me. Sons of bitches. I really was not looking where I was going, was I? Alright, fair enough, fair enough. Let me turn on my shoulder light. Alrighty. So... Where do I go next? I don't know. I don't think there's anything else up here. So, let's go down. And... Let's just start shotgunning stuff. Whoops. That's not my shotgun. This is my shotgun. Was I too close to it? I think I might have been too close to it. Yeah, too close to it. It's like the bullets are going through it. Maybe there's not that much good stuff in this one. I don't know. I don't think I usually get this part of the ship. I usually get the front part of the mid part, I guess. See, now this is going to be much better. Watch this. Shift. Nope. Can't fit anything in there. Damn it. Ugh. That means I'm going to have to pause the video and go do some inventory management soon. It's just fine. Where is this damn core? If the core is buried, then the hell with it. I'm not going to be digging this thing out. And there, I'll bet you there's a lot of this ship that's buried. Got a drone in the area. At least I think I do. I don't see him showing up. Oh, yeah, he's showing up. There he is. Two of them. Oh, boy. I'm not messing around with this thing. We're going with the big guns. There you go. That's what you get. Punk ass freaking drones. Okay. Well, we got everything in this section. Honestly, I don't think there's going to be too much here. Which is fine. Because I want to go check out that other place too. Can I shoot this thing, please? Can I please shoot this slope non-transparent thingy-mabob? Come on, it's a piece of glass. It's probably armored or something. There we go. Alright, I'm not seeing anything interesting around here. Let's see how fast I can dig. If I go to terrain terrain removal. Now, terrain removal digs faster, but you don't get anything back. I don't know. Is this even worth it? Probably not. But whatevs. Let's try it anyway. Why not, right? Look at this freaking butterfly. Get out of here, butterfly. Oh, here we go. There's something down here. Okay. Well, that, that wasn't... That didn't take that long. Okay, so this comes out to here. This is the elevator we were up in before. Alright, I've dug out about all of this I want to do at the moment. I'm pretty sure I've gotten most of it, if not all of it. And uh, let's get some looting. The loot down here doesn't even look that good. Like, it's not even special stuff. Like, I don't know, the digging wasn't really worth it. Like, But... At least now we know. It did satisfy our curiosity. We did get a lot of healing items, so that's good. And then uh, we dug up here. And there's even more stuff up here. Oh, so the blue containers are the useless ones. I see. And the gray ones are good. Yeah, these are, these are garbage. These blue ones. But I'm here, and it's loot, so... Let's go ahead and grab some of it. I did have a drone attack while you... Well, uh... I was doing some off-camera grinding. You know, it kind of sucked, but we took care of it. Alright, is there anything over here? Probably not. It looks like this just goes outside, right? Oh my god, there's even more? Oh my goodness. Oh, you gotta be kidding. 
Guys, I'm sorry. I can't. I can't. The, the digging in this game is putting me to sleep. Can't do it. Not worth it. Can't do it. Not doing it. All right. Well, let's just get out of here. I think we've gotten about everything out of here I really care about. And let's go up to the north and check out the admin TS Akua. And we're going to keep a lookout for the small outpost and the Epsilon Fortress. I don't know if I took those out yet. I think I did, but, you know... You know, you think you took something out and you take it for granted. Next thing you know, the, the tower's shooting at you. It's just not a good sign. So, and don't worry, guys. Next episode, we are 100% going to be done with this. I will just leave this running if I have to. Because we are going to have the base. I love it. I need a name for the base. I don't you guys. If you guys can think of any names for the base, let me know. If not, I'll come up with something. Because I do want to name the base. This base I've been working on for... I don't know, a couple alphas now. And, um, you know, I really, I should really spend the next few videos really, really building. I've got an idea for the fourth pillar. The base basically has four pillars. Um, the first one is... Actually, what is the first one? The first one's going to be, like, utility stuff. Um, oxygen generators, uh, healing items, places to spawn, stuff like that. The second one is where I grow my crops. The third one is the hangar. And all three of those, well, actually the first one isn't quite done yet, but it's going to be done pretty soon. We should also check out that small outpost. Um, and the last one's going to be crafting and storage. I built this crafting and storage one in my mind, so that is pretty sweet. So, All right. So this looks like one of those civilian bases with nothing good in them. But, oh, look at that, trading. I got your trading right here. I traded missiles. Oh, okay, I guess I can't destroy their stuff. Whatevs. I'll find their... I'll find the core and get rid of it, and then I will destroy their stuff. Oh, look at that little... Look at this right here. No building. Interesting. Alright, well, let's check this place out. Maybe it'll be cool. This is probably the kind of thing you really want to... Like, you need multi... This is the kind of thing that I think is really made for multiplayer. But... Oh, look at this. Yeah, a little trading thing. Okay. So, I see. So, if this is multiplayer, you could have people over here... Hanging out, trading stations. These are the um, these are the trading stations. This is probably an ATM machine. You could, yeah. I mean, the multiplayer in this game seems pretty cool, guys. I should try and get a multiplayer server up. Um, I I'm really debating it. I'm really debating it. The only reason I haven't gotten a multiplayer server up just yet is I don't really no core present. Is I I honestly don't have the time to dedicate enough videos of this game a week to make a multiplayer worth it. You know what I mean? So, eat and drink. Yeah, this is pretty neat. I like this. I like this. Although, like I thought, you know, since I'm not playing multiplayer, it's it's pretty useless to me. It's a good looking place. Trading. Yeah. Yeah, I can see this. Man, multiplayer. Mm. Once my schedule clears up and I can afford to, you know, put more videos of this up per week... Uh, I should definitely, definitely get a multiplayer thing going. Pretty nice base. There's nothing here for me, though. Yeah, that goes back. Okay. Oh, these are multiple. Wait, what is this? Oh, wow. This is a good-looking room. Oh, man. This is... Oh, I can't even go in there. This is one of the better-looking rooms I've seen. I've seen rooms in this game, but this is this tops them. That's what I needed. That's what I need in my base. I think the fourth pillar will be will be healing, uh, you know, medical station, oxygen station, and maybe I'll put some living quarters in there as well in the fourth pillar of the base. If you don't know what I'm talking about, four pillars of the base, or you've never seen this base, just wait one more episode, guys. I'll sh I will show it to you. So I'm guessing this is... I don't know why there's three doors here. Oh, that's why. Because these are like apartments. Wow. This is a really nice building. I like this. Okay, that's probably just more apartments. Yeah, okay. Let's get out of here. I don't think there's anything here for us, to be honest. Pretty cool, though. I do... Uh, I think it's a cool base, though. Alright guys, we are heading over to the small outpost. Here we are, let's crash landing. Pretty sweet, pretty sweet. <laughs> it's pretty nice that you don't have any uh, 
crashing damage in the game. Although I kind of wish they would add it. I'm kind of su I'm surprised they haven't. Oh, easier, buddy. I'm kind of surprised they haven't added like crash damage. You know, it's one of the um, it's one of the weak points of this game that it, you could just like oh cool that actually works on my ship that you could just like crash into anything and take no damage. Oh wow, this is a really nice building too. Look at this. A TV? What, do we just stand here to watch TV? Where's the seats, people? Come on, man. What are we... Animals? We're just gonna stand up while watching TV? Oh, wow. That's a good find. Too bad I already have one. What's this? Nothing? What we got in here? Oh, a toilet. Wow. It's like a... A porta potty. It's kind of a shame you can't go in there yet. No oxygen. What's this? Welcome to Delta 9R... Sorry, R9... Welcome to Delta 9 R&D. Arrivals. Departures. Don't forget your Delta... Okay, fair enough. Oh, is this supposed to be a... Is this supposed to be a metal detector or something? This should be a really slick airport. What's this? Is this like uh, the control tower? Let's take a look at the control tower. Anybody up here? Knock, knock. Okay. Um, okay. Control tower. No windows, huh? I guess it's all done with, uh, you know, radar and stuff. Space radar. I don't know. <laughs> Space radar. <laughs> Space radar. What's down here? Is that the core? Ah, alien? Alien? I don't think I'm going to shoot the core, because I don't really care. If I ever want to come back here and take things apart, then I'll shoot the core, but... For now, it's fine. Okay, so are these little, like... Like bungalows or something? Uh, kind of. No, maybe restaurants. Probably restaurants or something. Nah, it's not, it's not big enough to be a restaurant. Wow, this is a, this is a fancy schmancy bathroom. Oh, what do we got in here? What do we have here? Anything in here for me? Oh, cool. I'm going to have a meat burger and wash it down with some baked pumpkin. There we go. Can't go in there because of the core faction. That's fine. Probably nothing in there anyway. Emergency rations are always good. Oh, I didn't realize you could... I didn't realize you could do these cabinets. Although I probably should have. Man, this is nice, dude. This is really nice. I wish I lived on Akua. Like, in real life. Although, what happened to the windows here? Hmm. Oh, this, this reminds me a little bit of my... The place I was living to. This is, reminds me of the place I was living before I had to restart the world. Okay. Oh, these are the crappy ones. What's that behind it? Oh, it's part of it. Nothing. 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 Alright, guys. I think we are coming up to the end of this video. Let's make sure we've looted everything here. Honestly, I think we've done about everything I want to do on this planet. I think the next few half dozen episodes are going to be us laying down the base, working on the base, and starting to save up materials for a capital vessel to take us off this planet because we I think we've been and done just about everything. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, we're going to call this one here. That is going to be it. I will see you next time, and until then, take it easy.